What's up, guys? So, Red Coat number one comes out on Wednesday, April 3rd. I got a chance to read this over the weekend and just wanted to tell you a little bit about it. Now, as always, I'm not going to show you any interiors because I don't want to be the source of any leaks or any spoilers. But this was a really fun book. If you read the, I believe it was the Geiger 80 page special from several months back or the Ghost Machine one shot that came out a couple months ago, then you're probably familiar with Red Coat already. This is written by Jeff Johns, the artist by Brian Hitch. This is part of Jeff Johns' Ghost Machine imprint at Image, and it is part of the unnamed Connected Universe, so along with Geiger and First Ghost and The Northerner and some other books that we're gonna get later, this is part of that whole universe. So if you're not familiar with the story of Red Coat, this actually has its roots in American history, like real American history except that there are magical elements and maybe the founding fathers were some powerful magic users we don't really know what that's all about yet we don't really know why they are or what all that's about i'm assuming we will learn that later but this book focuses on this guy right here his name is simon pure he is a british redcoat during the revolutionary war in 1776 he is granted the gift of immortality but i don't want to tell you how just in case you don't know i want to let you experience that for yourself because again it has its ties in american history and maybe there are some historical figures there so i will let you see how that all plays out as you read this book yourself the rest of this book follows him a hundred years later he is constantly being chased by people who think that he owes them money or that maybe he wronged somehow he's kind of a roguish scoundrel if you will uh, he's always broke he's always hungry looking for a place to stay kind of a little bit of a freeloader i guess but there's always somebody after him for one reason or another. But there's also a different group of people that are after him for much different reasons than everybody else. And they finally do catch up to him. And I think that's where this story is eventually going to go. So we don't exactly know yet uh, what specifically, what adventure he's going to get into. Uh, that's going to be probably the next issue or the issue after that. But this is basically just introducing us to Simon Pure, to Red Coat to you know his immortality what it's like for him to live uh for forever basically this actually gives me vibes of the highlander tv series from the 90s if you guys ever watched that you know um duncan mcleod is an immortal and that series showed flashbacks of him at various points in time now this takes place in the early 1800s uh but it does flash back to some other times as well so i wonder if we will get more of Simon Pure Red Coat in other times, I'm not really sure yet, but uh, this is a really good introduction to this character and into his antics. So again, this book comes out on Wednesday, April 3rd. I highly recommend it. Uh, the, all of the Ghost Machine books that are coming out that day are fantastic. So let me know if you pick this up, and if you do, let me know what you think about it.